I know people. No, I'm sure you do. Take you, for instance, Alan. You have a certain energy about you. It's an active kind of energy. I wouldn't be surprised if you drank about 16 Diet Cokes a day. You're an excellent father, but you feel guilty about the time you spend away from home. You drink bourbon, but you offer your clients scotch. And your wife decorated this office. <laughs> Certainly seems to have your number. You're a little tougher, Peter. For one thing, you like expensive things. That's easy. You've seen my car. <laughs> You smoke Hoyo de Monterey's. You're a Scotch man, single malt. Not because it's trendy, but because you've been doing it for the last 40 years and you like to stay with what works. You have two great loves in your life, your horses and this company. And you're a man who prides himself in finding talent in unusual places. How would you know that? Because I'm here. I'm prepared to do whatever it takes to get this job. I'll start wherever I have to start. I'll park cars if I have to. The biggest part of judging character is knowing yourself, and I know this. I can do this job. I can. Give me a chance, Peter. I won't let you down. Alan, why don't you show Jack around? This is our war room. We did seven major deals in here last year, three of them <coughs> hostile. Seven? Yeah. You got a kind of a feeling, you know, from a... Can we cut this shit here for a minute? I mean, what did you do? Where did you get that information? Did you go through his wallet? Did you surf some net? Something like that? It, it, it doesn't really matter because that circus act...